Blender 3.5 has officially entered beta and it came with a lot of new cool features that we're gonna discuss in this video. The new version of the software is scheduled to be released on March 29th of this year and it was announced by the Blender Foundation recently. This version has seen some more upgrades in different aspects of Blender including improvements to animation, modeling and rigging pipelines and also some promising improvements to the Grease Pencil tool. The proper gate pose operator has been updated where previously, to determine the target key, it was used to evaluate each F-curve independently. This led to undesirable behavior when the keys were not on the same frame. But it now discovers the frame first by verifying all the F-curves in question and then propagates the passer to it. If a key frame does not exist, it will just be added. Also, a new operator called Ease has been added to the graph editor and it allows you to align keys on an exponential curve. This can be very useful when you want to quickly make an easy transition on multiple keys. There are also some enhancements to the texturing and rendering tools where Cycles now uses a light tree to more effectively sample scenes with many lights. And this can significantly reduce noise but it comes with a cost of somewhat longer rendering time per sample. Following the tradition of Blender, a new splash screen has been introduced to this version where this time they chose something unusual without any crazy visuals or anything. It was just a cozy scene that Freelancer created. There are a lot of other new features and upgrades that have been included in this new version. So if you want to check the new things, you can go to the documentation page and you will find the necessary links down below. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please subscribe to the channel to keep yourself updated with the latest news of 3D software. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.